What's up, nerds? It's your boy. It's 9 o'clock in the morning. It's the 5th day of October 2022. It's about 70 degrees and hazy here at Site B. It is Yom Kippur, the Jewish New Year. So Happy New Year to all my Jewish friends. And you know how every week when I go through the list of products and Kickstarters and crowdfunders and new stuff, I say, well, this week's winner for best game company name is... I realized last night that maybe I should actually, you know, shout out these companies who I say have the best game company name and maybe uh, talk about them a little and give them a little free press. So this week's winner for best game company name is Pirate Gonzalez Games. Let's go to their site. It is at www.pirategonzalezgames.com. Shout out last down below. They are the creators of the Beacon role-playing game. Let us see what we can find out about them. Pirate Gonzalez used to be a pirate, then he discovered gaming and decided to forgo his swashbuckling ways and enjoy playing and designing games. You know, you could do both. Pirate Gonzalez can be found on Twitter, talking about video games, RPGs, and gushing about Avatar, The Last Airbender, and Legend of Korra. Uh, and I guess the Pirate Gonzalez is Tim Gonzalez. Because, hello. Um, he has created the... Ancestry role-playing game. No, I'm sorry, the Beacon or Bacon role-playing game. It's a fi high fantasy tabletop role-playing game inspired by Lancer, D&D 4E, and Final Fantasy. Uh, and he is kickstarting it now. We have some examples of how the system works and the different types of individuals you can be in the world of Beacon. He also has created a series called Ancestry Awakened and Archive, uh, Archive of Magic Items. It's Ancestry Awakened is um, all new ancestries for 5e, including 40 new ancestries and an overhaul basic overhaul of the existing 5e races with new features. So this is one of those, you know, they're not races, they're ancestries. And he includes, uh, you can play an undead, you can play a tree. So remember, they're not races anymore. They're ancestries. Uh, he also has something called Archive of Magic Items, which I guess looks like a brand new collection of magic items and magic item rules for 5e and his homebrew game. And then we have a whole bunch of stuff that he's made for homebrew, including a 5e dinosaur game, um, some con some conversion, some stuff for Pokemon, uh he converted a couple other video games to 5e, it looks like. He has a store on DriveThru and a store on DMs Guild. Uh, link down below. So congratulations to Tim Gonzalez, the Pirate Gonzalez, for having the best name of a game company this week. If you want to check out Tim's creations, link down below. Who will win next week's prize for best named game company of the week? Or, knowing me, will I completely forget that I'm doing this? Only you can remind me and tell me. So remind me that I need to do this every week by subscribing to my vlog. See what I did there? And checking out Pirate Gonzalez down below. And then checking out my merch down below. Till next time, I'm the OG GM. That's it for me for now. I'm sure we'll have some controversy to talk about later today. But for now, I'm just going to... Go put my shoes on and empty the trash and be an adult for a few minutes. See ya!